Today we are discussing uh, the presentation of our final year project entitled is Conversion of Bicycle to Electric Bicycle. Myself, Abdul Hadi Kubar, along with my group mates, Abdul Mateen Khilji and Engineer Batul Fatma Sheikh. Uh, this is the table of contents for our presentation. It uh, consists of introduction, problem statements, OMC and objectives, components, methodology, applications, testing, assembly, market analysis, conclusion, and recommendation. Introduction of our project in electric bicycle or e-bicycle is a bicycle equipped with a motor to assist while pedaling. The motor will get its power from a rechargeable battery mounted on top of bicycle. In our project, we are going to design uh, an e-bicycle that will work on both pedaling and on batteries. Problem in statement for our project. Conventional bicycles rely solely on human power. Bike, uh, if we can uh, use bikes instead of bicycles, bikes will add cost of air filters, spark plugs, and oils, which is very cost costly. Uh, difficult uh, uh, if we use heavy vehicles which are very difficult in uh, traveling in urban areas for short distances aims and objectives for our project uh, making an existing conventional bicycle capable of switching between electric and pedaling and to cut down on exhaust emission and reduce efforts selection of appropriate pmdc motor and design a speed controller for uh, pmdc motor integrating motor, controller, and batteries on a traditional bicycle. Com components required for our projects are following uh, the battery, motor, mode controller, charge controller, speed controller. First of all, battery. The battery which we have used is a uh, sealed lead acid battery, which is uh, has rating, uh, rated as seven ampere hour current, 12 voltage and weight 4.4 kg. And we use two batteries in a series to produce 24 voltage and 7 ampere hour current. Charging time it takes are uh, two to three hours for fully charged. Then second component is uh, motor. We use a mid drive motor, uh, PMDC mid drive motor. Its power rating is 250 watt, voltage rating is 24 volts. Its speed is 2750 RPM and its torque is 9 Newton meter. If we uh, discuss the working principle of PMDC motor, it has a permanent magnet on its stator while it's uh, winding our coil on the uh, rotor, which is connected to the circuit by using bushes and commutators. The uh, third component is charge controller. We have used the PWM power pulse width modulation based uh, charge controller, which has current rating of 20 ampere. Its voltage rating is 12 or 24 auto voltage rating. It uh, sends the voltage and perform accordingly. We have used this charge controller to prevent uh, our batteries and motor from heavy current or surges or any type of short circuit issue. Mode controller. Uh, a riding mode is specified uh, configuration on an electric bicycle that determines how the rider wants to ride his bicycle. Either he wants to ride his bicycle on a generator mode in generator mode, either he wants to ride his bicycle on a fully pedaling mode, or he wants to produce some power during the riding. This uh, task will be uh, configured or uh, just, justified by the using the mode controller. Recording here. Video demonstration. Then this is the PCB design, which we have designed for the mode controller do ourselves. Uh, this uh, PCB layout with the traces and uh, along with the soldered components on the PCB, which we have used in our project. We, we uh, didn't imply this in the final design because its uh, traces are very small and, and they are not capable of taking or carrying high use currents. It will burn out. Then the we had uh, different modes for different operation. First one is the pedaling mode. In bicycle is ridden by the pedaling. Instead of drawing the power from the motor, we will not use battery power and both relays will remain normally open. Batteries will be isolated from the motor. In this mode, uh, our relay, both relays will be uh, behave as open and the charge controller and motor and batteries will be isolated from each other. 
and the motor will not get any power not it will produce any power are stored in the battery the second mode is generator mode in this mode a relay 2 will be active and connected to the charge controller now the dynamo will work as motor and it will store uh, produce some voltage which will be stored in the battery using the charge controller or through charge controller the third one is motor mode in the motor mode motor uh, relay 1 will be active and motor will be connected to the batteries through the speed controller and charge controller motor will uh, gets its power from um, batteries which through charge controller and, and its speed will be regulated through the speed controller then the third component uh, fifth component is speed controller the speed controller signal is sent to arduino through the press buttons if the signal is positive if the signal is positive the speed is increases and vice versa in the absence of any signal the speed will be maintained for the at the last uh, attained signal and continue moving at its current speed based on the signal input arduino sends a pulse with modulated signal pwm signal to h bridge the h bridge controls the voltages in response uh, to a pulse with its modulation pwm signal if the pwm signals has a, a very high <clears throat> value its width is increased then it will increase the uh, voltages to motor and motor will increase the speed and vice versa the second uh, second heading for our presentation is methodology we in the, our project we used two switches to differentiate or to uh, distinguish or to select the mode of operation to motor and generator to user to control its mode of our bicycle either the rider wants to ride his bicycle on generator mode or in motor mode bicycle modes are pedaling and full motorization mode uh, partial pedaling combines human and motor energy if uh, we are uh, riding our bicycle on um, motor mode and we cast also uh, pedaling then it will increase the speed by reducing our human efforts we have also another mode which is fully pedaling mode converts motor to generate for energy in a to store then we had uh, uh, then the other heading is testing we had tested our motor at no load battery of no load uh, uh, battery no load lab experiments conducted on pmdc motor for understanding behaviors and capabilities use of 12 to 12 volt batteries ensured stable power supply emphasizing accuracy and reliability low power lab testing performed to enhance safety and dependability for real world scenarios pmdc motors innovative uh, 24 volt battery backup system demonstrated in continuous it uh, draws a 0.8 ampere current showcasing reliability and efficiency even under no load conditions it's a video for uh, uh, no load testing which we have performed then we have tested our motor at load pmdc motor safely installed on bicycle after rigorous lab testing innovative chain and gear system seamlessly connected connects motor to rear wheel showcasing integration and capability motor operates effectively with both 12 volts and 24 volts highlight highlighting designs were stability it's uh, evidence for load testing which we have performed on our motor then we have the speed controller then we had tested our logic of speed controller which we had uh, first initially discussed that the speed controller extend extensively tested using arduino coding feature of our pwm based on digital input signals lab view a robust graphical programming in environment employed for real time monitoring and visual representation of controllers activity lab use data visualization and analysis capabilities enhanced undergoing of controller op controllers operation arduino id terminals are uh, utilized to analyze pwm signal data mining duty cycle and frequency for fine tuning and optimization 
we have implemented our logic for speed controller on the Arduino using the lab view platform. And we analyzed that, that our logic was working quite fine. So we implemented it on hardware later on. This is the lab speed controller designs, uh, evidences which we have implemented on hardware. This is the PWM signal points value which has uh, been uh, presented on the laptop. If we press the positive button, it increases the value. If we press the negative button, it decreases the value and also decreases the speed as well. Assembly. To prevent, we, for assembly, we have discussed so many designs with the uh, vendors and with the teacher, you know, our supervisor. To, to finally, where do we have to place our motor and how do we can will connect it to the wheels or bicycle. To prevent the bicycle from tripping over, we put the motor on the back wheel rather than the front. Different gears will be employed to slow down the motor. The bicycle's rake will serve as a permanent storage for the battery and the controller. Bicycle with integrated electric assist uh, systems typically have a speed regulator built onto the grip with a relay switches also located there. Then we have market analysis uh, uh, to uh, distinguish our project with them, compare our project with the available electric bicycles in the market. The first one bicycle, which is cost are one like 20,000 and the gap below given is uh, specifications. It's from the year and a few tech electric cycle models given. And the second one bicycle is 94,999 um, electric bicycle. And this third uh, design, which is cost is approximately 75,000. And this is the specifications with specifications. This is a table which in which we have compared different uh, bicycles online with our bicycle. Uh, with, we have also compared our bicycle with the electric bike as well. The main, uh, if we consider or uh, compare the cost of our bicycles, then the, our bicycle have a very low cost compared to with other uh, vehicles. The, but uh, along with the cost, we have an additional feature which is not present in the other um, electric bicycles or electric bikes as well. They are not capable of charging themselves, but our design is capable of charging. Its power generation is enabled. We can generate a power by riding a bicycle, the it bicycle as well. Its application, uh, it can be used easily for urban commuting health and fitness, it can be uh, used by disability access, delivery services, services, campus transportation as well. <clears throat> Conclusion, project converts standard bicycle into electric bicycle using a PMDC motor, batteries, Arduino based, PMW, PWM controller and board selector. Cost effective method demonstrated for eco-friendly electric bicycle conversion suitable for commuting and layer and there are three modes pedaling mode generating mode and motor mode offering flexibility and energy efficiency lead acid battery highlight highlight potential of battery technology and advancement while balancing of performance and cost project showcase team is, is skills initiate and problem solving contributing to electric mobility and eco-friendly transportation advancement this is the recommendation of future work, which we, if we, anybody is uh, willing to uh, work further on our project, if he can or he or she can work on, investigate better battery, battery options, interface and uh, display, maximize electric bicycle effectiveness, uh, regenerative braking of regeneration power module, <clears throat> focus on design aesthetics for seamless user experience with the replacement of components, Conduct comprehensive testing for range performance and issue identification under various conditions. That's all about uh, our presentation. Thank you so much.